Good morning guys. So it is Sunday morning and I don't know if I'm going to vlog a lot today, but um, Mike and I are going to McDonald's breakfast. Um, I woke up and I was like, I want like McDonald's pancakes. I don't know. I used to eat those a lot when I was younger. We'd sleep at my aunt's house and uncle's house and he'd go get us like McDonald's breakfast and I'd always get the like hotcakes with sausage and a hash brown. And I used to get this orange drink, but I don't think they make it anymore. Anyways, can you tell something different about me? I got some new Ray-Bans yesterday, but they're not the ones that are like slanted on the side because those just look really weird. This is what they're called. If you want to see the screen name, you can just pause it, but I'll also link it down below. And just like a little heads up, I always link as much as I can of clothes, makeup, sunglasses. I always link as much as I can to, you know, just make it easier on everyone. If I tell you to check the down bar or like look in the down bar, it's not to be rude. It takes time to make those links and like find links for everything. So if it's in the down bar, it's just easier for everyone if like you just check. If it's not in the down bar, of course, like ask me because that's like my fault. My aviator sunglasses, they're always linked and of course I'll add that to the sunglass post as well. Do you want to show your sunglasses? I'll show them. This is Mike's pair. They're also Ray-Bans. I mean, I'll try and find the link for these also. Um, I just uploaded my guy's gift guide, the gift guide for boyfriends, and sunglasses were a gift, and this is part of his gift, but they were like on, we got them for like $80. That's like part of his gift. Mike, can you show us? Can you show us your sunglasses? No, on you. <laughs> I haven't had this since I was like so young, but the hash browns are so good. I'm so excited. What did you get? Oh, you didn't get. Did they put egg? Where's your beanie? It's itchy. It's From a bit hot. Oh, you're just not used to it, maybe. Oh. I look like I'm gonna rob a bank. You're doing a badass. But I look like I'm gonna rob a bank. I can't wear hats. That's nice. They're made in Italy. Whoa. It says on that. Chris? Yeah. Which ones are yours? The Wayfair. Why do you why do you have a cool name? Mine's just like Chris. Chris. I don't like Chris. Do you like this watch? Where's the the fifth watch? Yeah, it's nice. Um this jacket was in the gift guide video also. He always wears it. Yeah. Do you recommend that? Make sure I have a, a, a lint roller. Yes, we should get a lint roller while we're here. And Lulu pants. I didn't include those. The city joggers are his go-to. Yeah. I bought them for him. I need these puppies. You're just the most spoiled boy in the world. I Literally know. everything you're wearing, I bought you. <laughs> you didn't buy my hat and my t-shirt. You bought these boxers, too. Oh, risque. The Calvin Kleins. Yeah. Literally. Oh my god, you're the most spoiled brat in the world. Yeah. What are those? What are those? What are these? Have any of you tried these? They look like diners driving it and dives. Moritz premium premium icy cups. They have strawberry and mint. Let me know if they're good. Cappuccino sounds good. Okay, so I'm in the Walmart men's section and I'm getting this like crew neck sweater because Mike has one. Ugh. This is obviously like a large. And it is so comfy. They're only like twelve dollars. I'm gonna get a small. It's still gonna be kind of big, but just like lounge around. Like seriously, they're the softest sweaters inside. I stole his one time, and then I I knew I had to get like my own because it was just so soft. I'm gonna get a gray, but so soft. I need one. You guys all need one. Seriously, come to Walmart. Twelve dollars. Get a sweater. Um, you kind of look like Sons of Anarchy. That's the point. It's for work. Wait, a hold the show. Okay, here. Which one? Um, it's a large. I don't know. Try the medium on again. Cause medium like, fitness is not a good idea. Yeah. I mean, that's fine. It's not for fashion. It's for work. It's for fashion. Oh. <laughs> you should get a Wrangler t-shirt, cowboy. I feel like medium looks better. Yeah. But this is the only medium like that. Okay, well, do you need it today? Yeah. Or do you want to go, go to a different Walmart? No. I'll pour it. I can do it myself, but Mike is being my nice slave and putting. It's hard. Is it hard? I don't want any spillage. Got it right in the hole. I suggest everyone knows how to pop their own head. One time I helped Mike's, one of the guys on Mike's hockey team pop his head because he didn't know how to. He didn't know how to, and I felt so cool. Do you remember that? Whoa. It is around pretty rough right now. I hate coming back with a bag 
because I never I'm not good at unpacking and I it ends up just like sitting in a bag forever I'm the worst at unpacking anyone will tell you that I'll literally it'll literally be like I'll be home for a month and my baggage will still be packed I want to like do like a luxury night tonight like a luxury pamper routine it's not like a super luxurious thing it's like showering like a deep conditioning stuff like that but I want to like exfoliate my body and like put on self tanner and do a face mask because Mike did a face mask last night and today and he like loves the Amazonian clay mask whatever so I want to go do that like I'm not trying to come in your lane bud like you don't need to start speeding on up my men's gift guide video I feel like I look super rough today um I didn't really wear any makeup so it's just like a leftover from last night we fell asleep watching a old Morgan Freeman movie kiss the girls with Ashley Judd I feel like I saw it a really long time ago but we watched it and we fell asleep on like this little mattress that like Mike has like in like the TV area and I woke up at 2 I'm like hey like let's go to bed if I wake up in the middle of the night like I can't keep sleeping there like I need to be in like an actual like bed and stuff so I'm on my way home I bought I'll show you guys what I bought at Walmart today but I'm tired of this nail color and I want to file them down I am gonna go to a new nail place just because I don't like the way that I was treated last time at Nini Nails. You know what, honestly, even if it was more expensive, I'd rather give my money to like a place with better customer service because like I just don't appreciate the way that I was treated, especially when I heard she did the same thing to like other people. I think I'm gonna go to where Tony gets her nails done. Like I'm looking at like my middle finger nails, like I'm not trying to flash you off, but like they're two different shapes and sizes and I'm just like over it. Tony got a new car. I haven't even driven in it because she gets home either really late from work, but she got a um, a Mercedes, a 2015 Mercedes, and I'm not really a Mercedes girl, like it's not really my favorite car. I prefer, honestly, I'm not putting down my sister because like as long as she loves it, like that's what's important, but when it comes to like those luxury cars, like I prefer BMWs and Audis over Mercedes. Um, when it comes to like little cars like this, um, but the inside of her car is really, really nice. It's like has like sport seats and stuff and like really futuristic looking. So I don't know if she's home now. Maybe I'll go for a little ride, but I'm happy for her. But isn't it funny? Like my sister, she's very, we're very similar, but very different. Like my sister, she, um, she wanted a Mercedes and me, like my dream car is a Jeep, like a Jeep Rubicon. Like that's my Jeep. That's my dream Jeep which I will be getting in the spring. The thing is, is like I don't really want to sell this car because I love my little white BMW. It's like so me and I, in a dream world, I'd love to be able to like keep both. I don't need people commenting like, oh, I don't like the Jeep. Like, I haven't even driven one. Like I haven't been in one. So I have to go like test drive and obviously I'm going to do research. But like I have a couple friends who have Jeeps and they all love them. So I don't know. Like I feel like when people end up getting dis disappointed with things, it's because they don't do enough research and they just kind of jump right in. And with me, like, I do a lot of research, so, yeah. But I got a lot of comments also from people saying that they love their Jeeps. And so, I, ugh, whenever I tell anyone that I want to get a, a Jeep Wrangler, they're like, oh my gosh, I could so see you in one. So, here's my bag that needs to be unpacked. I'm the worst at unpacking. I got a lot of questions about this bag. It's a Louis Vuitton bandolier keep all 55. It was, like, my dream, like, Louis Vuitton bag. It's something I always knew I wanted to have ever since I was a little girl. So, like, I'm really happy I have it. It's really good for traveling, like, overnight. But it is so big. I want to get, like, this is a Keep All 55. I want to get, like, a Speedy 40 Bandolier. Um, or something like that. Like, a little bit more my size. I'm, like, 5'3", like, 115 pounds. So, this is, like, really big. If I show you... I mean, it's really heavy, too. Because it's, like, heavy canvas and leather. So, Mike always carries it. But, like... I don't know if you're, you can see like how big it is, but it's pretty, you can't really tell, but just know that it's really, really big. But again, it's like, it was always like my dream bag by Louis Vuitton. I personally would not buy any of the luggage just because, I mean, I'm not flying private jets here. All right. Well, maybe like a little rolly like carry on thing, but I wouldn't get like a luggage to throw on the plane. Anyways, what I got from Walmart, I got acetone nail polish remover i just you know people comment and say oh acrylic isn't good for your nails and like i really appreciate you guys looking out for me but i'm not like i'm so bad like i'm not like i don't care my nails suck anyways i have i bite my nails like they suck so 
either way, I don't really care. Um, this is by Hard Candy. I swatched it when I got into the car, and it's the it's a single eyeshadow in Sandy Beach. It's a really pretty bronze color. The Buxom shadow that I thought I liked, uh, I think it's in Tony's room. It was called Bold Bling, and it was really nice when I swatched it in Sephora, but I got it in the mail, and it's like orange. So I'm gonna go return it. This is by Hard Candy. It was like four dollars, and I swatched it. Uh, and it is like, it looks like, honestly, it looks kind of like a leopard thing on top when you get it. But then when you mix all the colors, it just turns into this super smooth, creamy bronze color. The perfect bronze color, like not orangey. The nail polish I got from American Apparel, there's no name on it. It was in this little holiday trio that I got. And it was only $6.90 for three nail polishes. The other two are over there, but they're glitter. Let me get them. Um... They're like glitter, and I don't wear this, so I don't know. Whoever wants them, like in my life, they'll get them. But um, this dark red was beautiful. Let's see how this acetone remover works because I have no patience for like the gentle nail polish remover. I'm like, no, I want this off with a chainsaw. Oh my gosh, that's so good. I last time I decided to change my nail color, it literally took like. 20 minutes. BLTs are some of my favorite, it's probably like my favorite food right now. And I've been watching this YouTuber, well these YouTubers named Brothers Green Eats or whatever. And they taught me a trick about how to cook bacon because like I hate, I normally I use turkey bacon but we don't have. But if you just, and this isn't just for me, it's for Mike and I. If you heat up your pan with the bacon, like you put the bacon on a cold pan and then heat it up at the same time, it like makes the perfect piece of bacon. So that's just a little life hack tip. I had a lot of leftover bacon grease and i apparently not supposed to put it down the drain. So I just made like a quick potato, onion, garlic hash really quick. I felt like I was on chopped and Mike, did you approve? Would you eat it again? I love potatoes, so this was pretty good. Hi Bentley boy. Why are your ears back? Why do you look so nervous? This is Bentley's chair. Bentley is a little Pomeranian, but he's, I don't know why he acts so nervous. He hates Mike. You're cute though. You're cuter than Mike. Yeah. Look at that little face. I'm leaving the mall now and I'm so annoyed because Victoria's Secret keeps on changing the stupid promotion. So the first time I went, everyone, everything was $10. And then when I went back Saturday, everything was like buy two, get two free. And now there's no sale. So I think Tristan's just gonna get one for me. Anyways, uh, they did the return at Sephora. The girl was so nice, which I was so relieved because um, Tristan had just gone in. I saw her when she was walking out and they were like kind of like bitchy to her. Um, I returned the eyeshadow. I didn't return the little eyeshadow holder because it was like a dollar. I'm not that cheap. I wasn't planning on buying anything at Sephora, but I've been wanting to get like a good cuticle cream um, or oil. I've been using like olive oil and honestly, it, like I'm Greek, I have olive trees in Greece and like I just feel like olive oil fixes everything. So like I've just been using like olive oil on my fingers um, like at nighttime. During like that little checkout, I saw this little set by L'Occitane and my mom loves the L'Occitane hand cream. I buy her one every Christmas, but I never really like bought it, but this was only six $16 and I only had to pay like because the eyeshadow was 50 and I only had to pay like a dollar for this I think it's a really good deal like it's $16 and you get like three of these things and I think the packaging is so cute Arnie Miss Gold Girl is one of my favorites on YouTube and she always talks about this I ordered a oil diffuser on Friday night was it Friday night Thursday night I ordered it off of Amazon Prime because I got a free month of Amazon Prime it was like $35 and I'm getting it today so I need to stop and get some oil I really like this nail color. It is the American Apparel Nameless Nail Polish. I'm gonna file my nails down a little just because I want them a little shorter. I got the big one. They were on sale at Farmer Free, so Mike got one, I got one. It was like $8 for two, so I got it. Anyways, I'm off to Farmer Free now to get some oil. Or maybe I should wait. I wanna go home and maybe film, possibly, the oh, Diva Cup follow-up video. Whoa, can you slow down in your van? You're on the wrong side of the road. Don't give me dirty looks. I'm on my way home now. Oh, I want to stop at that restaurant and see what kind of soup they have. Because, oh, it's only, oh, they closed soon. I don't know. The soup was so good. I think I'm going to go for lunch with Liz tomorrow, maybe. So, but Let me know what videos you guys want to see. I'm planning on doing Vlogmas, a video every day. Definitely let me know what videos you want to see, what videos you want to see with Tony. Oh my gosh, guys, please alert the media. I'm driving with no hands. I'm driving with my knee because I'm putting my hair up. Oh no. I hope you guys had a great weekend. Thanks for watching today's vlog. 
And thanks for all the support on the Diva Cup video.